right, the grind is over. I have finally gotten my 300 program stars and I have unlocked 99 overall Roberto Alomar. He was my choice. He was the guy I wanted to go with. Um, my number two pick would be Verlander and then number three would be Ricky. But this Roberto Alomar card has everything you need, man. He's got the crazy contact, 121, 98. He's got pretty solid power at 74, 79 with 120 vision. He's got 93 fielding with 81 arm strength. He's got 87 speed with 97 stealing. And the biggest thing that's really exciting about this card, he's a switch hitter. This guy can do so much for you, and just judging off his attributes and what he brings to the table, I do think this is the best second baseman in the game right now. Better than Hornsby, better than Morgan, better than Mazeroski. I think Alomar right now is the guy. People were asking me how I got to 300 program stars so fast, and I mean, people got it last week, so I'm kind of low-key slow in the grand scheme of things. Um, but I have 300 stars. I did the 10 wins in BR rank seasons, the online wins, basically. I did the conquest. I did all of these moments I did the voucher and then one thing you guys can't forget about is the daily missions the daily missions give you a ton of stars every single day if you're willing to just sit there and do the mission there's always an exchange which is worth somewhere between two to three program stars there's always a missions inning so like Texas Rangers innings 15 innings with Texas Rangers players all you have to do is put a Texas Rangers player at every single spot in your lineup play two innings of a CPU game and you can quit and you get that challenge done and you get two stars out of it and there's usually two online missions um, some of them can be kind of annoying like a gold complete game that one's gonna be kind of annoying but either way um, don't forget about these ones and uh, yeah man 300 stars I'm here I'm happy that I get to finally use this program boss so Roberto Alomar is gonna play second base for me in the outfield I've got Joey Bats in right Tony Gwynn in center and Cody Bellinger in left I got Wade Boggs and Tim Kugler on the left side of the infield Frank Thomas over at first with Pudge behind the dish and overall I think this team is looking beast I'm ready to get into a game let's see what Roberto Alomar is all about we're the home team taking on the Los Angeles Hitmen. He's got Tony Gwynn, Mike Trout, uh, second baseman creative player, Ernie Banks at short, Giambi at first, Vlad in right, Rendon at third, Jason Kendall behind the dish, and we're facing 89 Bob Feller. And hey, I get to use 98 Mad Bum. First time using this card in ranked seasons. Down in the comments of this video, let me know which uh, third inning boss you're going to take. Are you leaning more towards Henderson? Are you leaning more towards Verlander? Or are you going to be like me and take... Uh, Roberto Alomar. I'm curious to see who people take. Um, I know there's just a lot of different opinions about who's the best and who fits well. Just, I love what Alomar brings to the table. I obviously really like Ricky Henderson as well. Just for me personally, my outfield is already so crowded um, that I just didn't feel like I needed him at the moment. I'm still going to buy him and get the voucher for the fourth inning program, but I do think uh, Alomar for me was the best choice. Change up. Oh, pops it over the shortstop's head. All right, leadoff base hit for Tony Gwynn. Look at this batting stance on his creative player, man. I think that's Eric Davis. That is just wild. There we go. Fly ball. This should be the second out. Make sure he doesn't go to second or anything crazy on us. Two down here in the first. He's not trying to run. Oh, it's a good swing on that cutter. High and inside cutter. He hit that pretty well. All right, he's got 89 speed in scoring position now. Curveball. Nice. Giambi swinging and missing. Got out of the inning. Two hits allowed, but it's okay. Nothing to show for him. Here we go, baby. Roberto Alomar. First at bat with him in ranked seasons. I'm excited. We're facing Bob Feller starting me off with 100 on the gun. My goodness. I've also got this goat bat skin on. As you guys know, I, I just got that from going 12-0 in BR. And right up the middle, Roberto Alomar is getting a base hit. Let's go. Got Tony Gwynn up next. Do I want to play around with the speed? Let's see. He's going slide step. For Whoa! Don't hit Tony! Bautista, base hit. Let's go. That's going to be three straight base runners. 87 speed. I'm going, boys. I'm going. Oh, wow, and I'm out. Rip. Who does he have in left field? Whoever that was, that he had a pretty strong arm out there. I don't even remember who he had. Bellinger, that's up the middle. That one should be scoring too easily. Let's go, baby. Mike Trout is not going to throw him out from center field. We got a 2-0 lead. The top of the lineup is coming up big so far. I did not even really mean to swing at that. I tried to check my swing. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Dude, I got to stop swinging at those bad pitches, man. I got two runs. I could have had a lot more. I got to put more pressure and be more uh, be more disciplined because I kind of, I got comfortable that inning. 
Here we go. Ground ball. Easy play for Kugler. 63 speed. Boom. Look at the cannon. <laughs> Frank's not scared. Frank's going to make the play. Another one. That is three straight swings. Three straight outs. Mad Bum's throwing good. Roberto Alomar up for his second at bat. Base hit up the middle in the first one. Where's the third baseman playing? All right, he's playing a little bit in, so I was thinking about maybe dropping a bunt down, testing out the speed going there, but I'll, I'll, I think I'll just try to swing the bat with him and see what I can get. Fastball at 99, up and in. He might go to another fastball high. He's really liking that pitch, and I've been biting, so let's see. Nope, okay, he's going away. Away, what was that, sinker? All right, 1-1. One, one. Come on, Alomar, let's get it. Another high and in fastball, 2-1. Not going to bite on that. I'm looking for the pitch over the middle that I can drive. Come on, Roberto. Oh, curveball. I would have swung at it, but it was a little bit too low. That's a really good spot. 2-2. Two, two. Come on, baby. Oh, that's not going to get over his head. Dang it, that high fastball. I'm having such a hard time laying off that pitch so far today. It's just my eyes get huge. Tony Gwynn, there we go. That should be a base hit. Swinging at the curveball, got it over his head. Let's go. Let's make something happen this inning. Let's get back into the run column. Running first pitch. That's a slider. That's an easy steal for Tony Gwynn. Yep, he's in there. Bautista, let's go. That's going to be another run. Jose Bautista just continues to clutch up for me. Every game, he's the best player in MLB The Show 19. Yo, look at Mad Bum. Look at Madison Bumgarner. He's got some pop, boys. That's a ground rule double. Two outs in the fourth inning. Mad Bum hits a ground rule double. Perfect PCI. Sets up Roberto Alomar. Alomar, get down. Get down. Oh, he made the play. Get out of here, Vlad. Why do you got to do that to me? Damn, Vlad just robbed a hit from Roberto Alomar. He should be two for three. That's rough. You hate to see it. Good hit. Man, this Ernie Banks keeps getting on base for him. Lead off hit in the seventh on a curveball. It's actually a really good swing. Come on, Mad Bum. I'm going to get the bullpen going just in case he gets in a little bit of trouble right here. I think I kind of trust him, but I just want to be safe right here. So we're going to get Nen and Miller warmed up. There we go. Double play. Come on, Frank. Start it off. Look at the spin from Frank Thomas. That's common defense. I don't think so. Oh my god, he keeps getting these blue pits, man. So many of his hits have been like he I don't think he's hit like a double yet or anything like that. Or he might have, I don't remember, but so many hits have just been blooped in there. Another hit up the middle. Two guys on. Oh my He's gonna get probably two runs out of that. Or he might only get one, but man, that's three straight hits. What's going on, Bum Garner? Come on, man. There it is. Throw to first. Finish the inning. Boom. Whew, he got a run. He was threatening right there. That could have been dangerous. He's out hitting me. Ah, it's a fly ball. I need more of the line drive bloop from Kenny Lofton. Well, it's two down now. Roberto Alomar is coming up. He's one for three, although he did get robbed of that hit in the uh, other at-bat where he hit it to left field. So he could very easily be two for three for me. But I need to be ready right here. That was supposed to be a check swing, but that's just awesome. All right, I'm down 0-1. I thought he was going to go fastball first pitch. Oh, my God. What a spot. What am I even supposed to do about that? 0-2 count. Come on, Roberto. That's a great pitch. God, that first pitch should have been a check. Come on. Cody Bellinger. Come on. Come on. That light, that's leaving. Let's go. Cody Bellinger. We finally got a high fastball that we could handle. Bottom of the eighth with two outs gives us an extra run of insurance. Bellinger is the man. Frank Thomas, base hit. Back-to-back -back hits in the bottom of the eighth here. Tim Kugler, that one might leave too. Yes. High fastballs are finally getting crushed. Thank goodness. We're now up 6-1. to one. All right, ninth inning, guys. Let's go. Ernie Banks starting it off with a fly ball. That's big. One out. Let's win this game and get it over with. <laughs> Andrew Miller can be filthy in this game, dude. Oh, my God. Two outs. Let's finish it. Vlad up. And that's going to be the third out. Right to Tony Gwynn. And that is another victory in ranked seasons, boys. So Alomar went uh, one for four, but he could have very easily been two for four if that base hit to left didn't get robbed by Vlad. It was a good catch. 
Um, but overall, I still like what he brings to the table as far as a switch hitter at the top of the order. Everything is good there. Bellinger was really the man for me today. Three RBIs, a home run. Tim Kugler had a two-run home run. Bautista, of course, two for four. When does he not go off for me? Bumgarner, eight hits in seven innings. Andrew Miller with the two-inning save. I think this game went pretty well. So, guys, down in the comments, let me know what you think. Um, who are you going to take for your third-inning boss? Drop a thumbs up on the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.